Hi guys, this is Ash here and in this video I'm gonna go ahead and show you how to stream videos from your Windows computer onto your Android device uh, with subtitles as well. So uh, there are a lot of streaming uh, options guys but this is the simplest and uh, the added advantage is that you can also access uh, you know, your files as they are from the Android device and you also get subtitles. So guys I'm actually showing you this on a Windows 7 PC. Uh, but this is applicable to Windows XP as well as Vista. Alright, the first thing you do is open up computer. And right now I'm gonna go ahead and share this uh, drive TV shows A through O. So uh, what you do is just right click on it, select share with and advanced sharing. So again, uh, select advanced sharing over here. Hit share this folder and uh, give it a share name. I'm gonna name it TV A through O and go on to permissions this is not necessary guys this is not mandatory but uh, this would be useful in some cases you know when you want to change file names and so on from your android device it would be useful so uh, granted full control hit ok ok close it alright now uh, now that this is done we'll move on to the android uh, part of this tutorial alright guys now on your android device uh, connect uh, to Wi-Fi on the same network that your PC is on and now go into the Play Store and search for ES File Explorer or uh, yeah and then go ahead and install it and of go back and also search for MX Player enough both are free free apps guys so just go ahead and install it again and now once you're done just wait for the installation to be done now once this is done just go ahead and open ES file explorer and uh, on top you see this local uh, over here just tap on local and select LAN and again over here add new and hit scan and once you've uh, found your uh, laptop or PC just hit back and select it it'll say login failure and uh, select OK and enter the, enter the username and password that you use for Windows this is my username and uh, just a minute okay now just entered my password and I'm gonna hit remember password and hit OK so over here you can see that the drive that we shared TV A to O is actually uh, shows up so uh, I'm gonna play Battlestar Galactica sorry right, guys uh, so the the file that you have, the DivX file or the AVI file uh, and the subtitle need to have the same names uh, for the player to uh, detect it. So right now I have it done already on my PC so I'm just gonna play an episode. Uh, once you tap it it's gonna ask you to open with and in case you've selected a default player already just tap and hold it and select open as and select video and then it'll ask you uh, what player you need to I mean you want to use so select MX player so there you see guys uh, you get you get the you're able to stream videos and you're also able to get subtitles and the best part is you can also skip uh, uh, you can also you can also scroll between I mean to different points on the video you know, that is the video doesn't have to totally buffer before you play it and guys over here you will not be able to you know go into subtitle and uh, open a new subtitle because uh, uh, the network uh, the network drive will not be detected by this app over here so that is the reason why you need the subtitle and the name uh, I mean the video name and the subtitle name needs to be the same so that it gets detected by default so over here guys, uh, the reason why I asked you to, uh, you know, uh, give the permissions as, you know, uh, full control is because 
if you need to rename a subtitle over here you can do it only if you have the permission so that is the reason why I asked you to select full control uh, in Windows so that's pretty much it guys uh, and apart from this you know, uh, using this app you can also go ahead uh, and use it to stream uh, you know photos and whatever file you need uh, so that's pretty much it guys for streaming video off your Windows PC uh, to your Android device with subtitles uh, so you know I was actually you know, kind of uh, I've been looking for a software to you know a method to actually do this for quite a long time to be honest uh, you know I kind of walk around in my house watching stuff and I'm not a native English speaker so I like to have my subtitles and I really haven't been able to get a solution to now and I was just uh, what do you say looking stuff up online I kind of came across uh, this setup I was just looking to do various stuff and I kind of stumbled upon it so I thought I'd let you guys know if in case if you are looking for looking to set it up the same way that you know I've been looking, looking for so that's pretty much it guys uh, thanks a lot for watching and before you go make sure you hit the like and subscribe buttons I will be coming out with more Android videos uh, so and if you guys do want to help me out use my links in the description that says uh, you know direct links to Amazon to buy uh, Galaxy Note X series and whatnot. Just use that link if you have anything to purchase off Amazon. Use go through my links and if you end up purchasing something, I tend to make a few cents to a few bucks. So that is if you guys want to help me out. So that's pretty much it, guys. Thanks a lot for watching and you guys have a great day. Bye bye now.